Hello friends, family, brothers and sisters. Um, it's Happy Fat Wood, Bacon Burn Friday. First and foremost, hashtag 22 a day. We have 22 vets commit suicide every day. One's too many. Trying to get the awareness out there, let them know we, we love them. You know, try to get them in touch with the right people that can help them. So we're trying to make the awareness um, for it. Um, also, I got a mail call from our brother Keith over at My Bad Adventures. He's part of the knife community. He's an Arkansas Razorback fan over there in Arkansas, but he sent me some fat wood bacon. I'm telling y'all, it's pretty. I done cut some of it up. I could smell it when I opened the package. Y'all look at that. Isn't that pretty? That's some pretty bacon. Nice and lean, and it's icky sticky, just like Brother Bill Milton's icky sticky. I wish we had smell it too so y'all could smell the different scents. It amazes me when you get fat wood from different places, even if it's the same type of pine. It has just a slight difference in smell, but it all smells delicious. But, um, that's another little piece of it that I have used to scrape up some scrapings with. And my bad, Keith. I appreciate it. Um, um, <clears throat> my prayer train's always going for everybody. We got several people in the community that needs prayers. My prayers are going out for everybody that needs them. And like I say, my fires, me and Brother Bill. If anybody can't make a fire, need needs one, or or is unable to make one for whatever the reason may be, me and Brother Bill's always sharing. Me and Brother Bill have a cup of coffee together every day, or more than more than a cup. I probably drink two or two or three this size a day. But um, I want to jump on here also and congratulate our little sister, Adia Loving. She got over 100 subs, so I can't wait to see what she does on her channel, with her first video on her channel. Um, I want to congratulate Bruce over at Fab Creations. He won the Moore Hatchet from Redneck Renegade for pushing Ron T. Sawyer over 500. Congratulations, Ron, on your channel growth. Um, I want to thank Scab and... Um, Megatron, they're pushing to get my channel up to 300 or over, and they're, I can't remember the name of the knife, but um, they're doing giving, a, giving away a knife, and uh, I appreciate all my new subs, of course, I appreciate all my old subs, creators and non-creators, um, but yeah, we're going to fire this thing up, y'all, and a oh, real quick update on the haunted house, uh, Friday, we had a little over 200 people come the first night. That was our first night open. That's when everybody's trying to get the feel of everything, you know, get, get going in the mood and all. And then Saturday night, we had over 800. So this weekend should be interesting. So, but yeah, we're having a good time. So like I say, it's all for a good cause and everything. So y'all know it's my favorite time of the year. So, but I want to do some quick shout outs other than the ones I already did. Y'all check out. Uncle Al over at Double Frog. The man's very knowledgeable, and he's got a lot of comedy in his stuff, too. Um, David West, because y'all fixing to see something that I, I told y'all about that he showed, he showed, and it made sense even when you, when you get a brand new ferro rod and you go to scrape it to get the, to the part that makes the sparks, scrape it into your tender bundle because it's got all the magnesium off the ferro rod even in the paint. So when you strike it, you get extra goodie in it. So, and, um, <clears throat> let's see. I done told y'all about my prayer train. I'm trying to think. It's hot and humid right now. I'm hoping it'll cool off because I don't like it hot like this. But um, I want to do something real quick. I don't know if y'all can see him. I know I've told y'all about him before. Let me see if I can get the camera where y'all can see him. Hey, Savannah. Can y'all see him? Hey, Savannah. I think he might be mixed with Bobcat. He don't meow. He'll let me get close to him within a foot. And he goes, shh. That's all he does. And then when I put his food down, I walk away two inches from him. He goes straight to his bowl to eat. So he's a beautiful cat, though. And Phoenix, of course, he's doing he's doing just fine. He's wild child. He's sweet and spicy, just like I say. But my wounds, my battle wounds are starting to heal. 
my legs are all scratched up too. Somebody asked me the other night at the haunted house when I didn't have my gloves on, they said, do you own a cat? And I said, whatever gave you that idea. <laughs> but my legs are all scratched up too. But he's doing fine. So, y'all, I'm going to try not to make this an extra long one, but I wanted to do some shout outs and check out Mark over at eCarves Outdoors too. He's always doing something interesting. And, uh, <clears throat> But yeah, I just want to jump on here real quick, y'all. Wish everybody a happy Fatwood Bacon Burn Friday. Let everybody know my prayers are going for everybody that needs prayers. And even people I don't know, I pray for everybody. Um, we're going to fire up our bacon. Arkansas Razorback Bacon. Let's see if we can get you down here where y'all can see. We'll try to get us a one and done. But if we don't, it's okay because Brother Bill likes the sound of the fair rod scratching anyway. As Jerv says, you scrape it like a carrot. But if you take it and go real slow, you scrape it some goodie off like this. I have to find my sweet spot on my striker. There it is. There you go. One and done. How it's done. Listen, can y'all hear that Arkansas bacon frying? Look at that. Keith, over my bad. Again, brother, I appreciate the fat wood bacon from Arkansas. And that's some that's some good that's some primo bacon. But yeah. Ain't nothing like a good fire for the soul. But anyway, y'all, I don't want to make it too long. But y'all, y'all tell somebody you love them because we ain't promised tomorrow. We ain't promised five minutes from now. I don't have any regrets. Stay humble and kind till my next one, y'all. I love y'all. Stay spooky. And uh, I will catch you on my next one. Oh, and real quick, if I didn't already say it, I wanted to give a... Uh, Shout out to my new subs. I greatly appreciate it. I might have already said this, but I can't remember. My mind just went. Phew. But um, all my new subs, my old subs. And if I haven't, like I said before, if I have not commented or liked your video, it's not because I'm not watching. I'm not getting notified of it. And I'm going through manually hunting everybody to key in their channel name so I can go on their channel. So if I hadn't got to you yet, I'm working on it. So y'all bear with me. I don't know why. We're not getting our notifications like we're supposed to, but that's somebody in the high tech department, I guess, that can explain that to me, but I don't understand it. But anyway, y'all, stay home on kind. I love y'all, and I'll catch y'all my next one. Thank y'all.